During the Manhattan Project here in Oak Ridge, segregation was the standard, uh, the order of the day. And black families coming here, while they were getting good jobs, getting better pay than they'd gotten anywhere else, they were treated differently than the white people coming here or other people coming here. One of the displays is this board that's behind me that talks about segregation. It even has a picture of the uh, Hutmans, the location of where the Hutmans were, which is now Woodland because they moved the African Americans out and moved them over to Gamble Valley so they could build uh, the Woodland area. There were a number of African Americans who were working here. Uh, most of them in laborer type jobs. A lot of it was with the construction. So they would have been out at Happy Valley. There was a, a little city of 15,000 people built out near the K-25 building while they were constructing that site. Now in, in the case of the African American women, you would have seen some of them as nurses. You would have seen some of them in uh, the cafeterias. Those kinds of areas in the cleanup of some of the dormitories working in those kind of jobs. This display tells something about the situation that existed here during the Manhattan Project and how uh, prominent segregation was just almost to the exclusion of allowing black people to be in any of the areas where the white people were.